Hi guys, so for today we are going to be opening uh, my latest Brea purchase, which isn't really a purchase, it was a raffle price from last weekend. This is the Brea Classic American Quarter Horse, it's now retired, it was retired at the end of last year, and it is the Bay Roan variation of this particular mould. So we're going to open him up and have a good look, you can see him here in his box. So we've got our trusty X-Acto knife to cut through the plastic, let's get him open. So here he is out of uh, his box, um, this particular one has the metal ties, not those really nice plastic ones which they started to put in the, um, the classic boxes a few years ago. Um, so we'll have a look and uh, hope that he doesn't have too many box traps, looks quite nice from here. Wire cutters, invaluable. thing to do. So here he is out of his box. As you can see he is really nice bay roan colour. I absolutely love the colour on this model and I've been wanting to uh, to buy one for a while um, so I'm quite happy with that. Condition wise he is in pretty pretty good condition. We've got a little bit of a box rub on the other side and the thing that really annoys me about this mould um, is because obviously the mane was put on afterwards because this is one of the show horse moulds. Um, there is a gap between the mane <laughs> and his head, which really irritates me, but that's okay. But yeah, he's generally really nice, so we're going to put him there and see if we can get the camera to actually focus on him. Bam, bam, bam. Okay, so we've got him down now, and so we'll have uh, some better shots of uh, what he actually looks like, if the camera wants to cooperate. So here you can see his front side. You can see that really nice roan colour, it's really dark on this model, but um, and there are definitely much lighter variations, but I think it's rather lovely. If we have a look at the other side, you can see that lovely roan coloration really covering the whole of the body, which is really nice. And uh, we can see his only rub, which is up here, if we can get it to focus. Oh, it's not having it. It doesn't want to focus today. It doesn't want the world to see the box rub, that's the problem. Oh well. We need my macro lens. I'll put some photographs up of him as well where you can see that he's got a little bit of a rub on his neck here. But not really the end of the world. Um, really nice model. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and um, check out any future videos. I'm hoping to do a few more unboxings and we'll look at some of the newer products we've had in at Chestnut Ridge recently. Um, so you can have a look at those. So uh, that's it from now. So goodbye from me. Goodbye from yet unnamed... Uh, called horse that camera does not like at all. There we go. And uh, goodbye from Brandy. You gonna say goodbye, Brandy? No, not gonna say goodbye. See you next time.